good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are diving into an epic, epic day, Brad. We got some epic stuff going on that I cannot wait to get into with you. And it's an exciting concept that I am very excited to announce to you guys and bring forth to you guys this uh, the last few days of this October month, right? We are in the month of October, Halloween coming very, very soon. So in the spirit of Halloween, me and Brad came up with this genius idea that I thought would be very fun for you guys, would be very fun for us, and I can't wait to get into it. So during the last 10 days of this month, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be diving into an MDT tournament, and it is going to be the MDT Tournament of the Damned, or an MDT World Horror Championship Tournament, Brad. So what we're going to be doing, guys, is we're going to take eight horror icons, put them into a tournament, and we're going to battle it out until we come out on top with the MDT Horror World Championship matchup. We'll get into the members of the tournament in just a few moments, guys, as you guys can see your different horror icons here. You guys can let me know who you'd like to see in the tournament. I've already selected the field, but you guys can, uh, you guys are actually going to play a role in it, so we, we'll get into that in just a few moments, but the MDT Horror Championship Tournament of the Damned. So what we're going to be doing here, man, is we're going to have eight combatants competing in a tournament-style bracket, single elimination. Every single matchup will be a death match in which each competitor will, will battle to the death, right? They will go until one can go, no longer go, and we're going to keep this process moving forward until we get to our championship round on Halloween night. I, I don't know if I'll premiere the matchup or if I will actually post the matchup just straight up, but to celebrate Halloween, you guys know we always do it big with the horror videos and all those things, so I thought this year it'd be really fun to do an MDT Tournament of the Damned here, and we're going to crown a MDT World Horror Champion on Halloween night with the finals being whoever makes it there. So you guys are probably wondering who is going to be in the field, who is going to be competing for the top prize in the MDT Horror Division here, and so we're going to get into that a little bit. So you guys know that if there's eight people, there will be four matchups in round one, two matchups in round two, and then one matchup on Halloween night to crown our MDT World Horror Champion or MDT Horror World Champion, whatever you want to say. Probably MDT Horror World Champion makes more sense. You guys know that we already have the Horror Championship, but this one is bigger than that. This is a bigger championship. This is a bigger deal than that matchup right there that takes place in the Horror Battle Royal, which should be coming in the next few days as well. But let's go ahead and break down the field, man. Let's go ahead and break down the field. Let's start off with the seeds. We did seed these guys up, and I'll dive into the matchups after we announce the field for the first round, but let's go ahead and announce who is in the field, man. Coming in at the eighth seed, we are going with Pinhead. We have Hellraiser slash Pinhead, or Pinhead from Hellraiser here. And coming in at the eighth seed, very underrated character, you know? Not a lot of people, I think, like, obviously he has a pretty big following, like, he's very well known. However, I don't think he is in the field with the rest of these guys, or I could be wrong, you guys may know who Pinhead is over the rest of the field, but I feel like he's one of the horror characters that gets slept on. He comes in at the 8th seed of the tournament. Coming in at the number 7 seed, ladies and gentlemen, we are going with none other than Ghostface. We have Ghostface from Scream entering in at the 7th seed. Should be a very exciting combatant here. One of the more aggressive killers in the lineup here. So we have Ghostface as the number 7 seed. That should be a really fun matchup, whoever he takes on. So Ghostface and Pinhead are our first two entrants. Number 6 is going to be the killer doll, Brad. We have Chucky. Oh my god. We have Chucky competing here, and you know the manager is going to be by the side. So we got to have Tiffany by his side. So Chucky is going to do war as the sixth seed. He may be undersized, Brad, but do not count him out. Dynamite comes in small packages, so you definitely want to have your eye out for Chucky. You want to have your eyes peeled for Charles in this thing. So we have Chucky as the number six seed, of course, with uh, with Tiffany at his side. Go ahead and pick this mess up. God in heaven. Look at Mr. Meeseeks over here. Coming in at the five spot, guys, we have, uh, well, this is where you guys are going to play a role. So we have two different options here. You guys can let me know what you think. The first one we have is going to be Pennywise. And then the second option is also going to be Pennywise. I apologize for that. They're both Pennywise, so I, I hate to spoil it. But you guys can select who is going to compete in the tournament. You guys want to see the, the remake Pennywise from, what was it, 2017? Or do you guys want to see the OG Pennywise in the Curry Pennywise? Let me know down in the comment section below, man. You want the OG or you want the remake Pennywise down in the comment section below. I'm down with either of them. I think if I had to vote, I'd probably go with OG Pennywise, because that's the one I grew up with watching until the remake obviously happened, but you guys let me know. You get you guys get to pick it, but he is going to be the five seed. We have Pennywise. All right, guys, time for the top four. Can you guess who they're going to be? Coming in at the four seed, we're going with none other than Fredith Krueger. We have Freddy Krueger coming in at the four seed. Should be an exciting matchup, whoever he gets to go to war with, and you know he's going to be pissed off that he wasn't one of the top seeds. You know he's going to be pissed off. He's going to be ready to go, so Freddy Krueger is going to 
square off as the four seed. Should be a fun one, but he is the number four right there with Freddy Krueger. Coming in at number three, we're going with Leatherface with Chainsaw in hand. Do not, you know, whoever gets messed up with him, gonna be a long night, Brad. You have Leatherface with his chainsaw in hand, gonna be the three seed, one of the top names in all of horror movie history. So Leatherface comes in there at number three. So guys, this is editing tray. Why the hell did I say names like that? What the hell was I doing, man? Need one of the top names, 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 names. And our top two seeds is going to be Michael Myers and Jason Voorhees. I'd say the two mass killers who are the most known. We have the two seed going to be Michael Myers. And the one seed is going to be Jason Voorhees. So hockey mask wielding and Captain Kirk mask wielding will go into the tournament as the two top seeds. So we have Jason Voorhees. He's number one, Michael Myers number two, and now that we have covered the field, so just to, just to recap real quick, we have Jason Voorhees one, Michael Myers at number two, we have Leatherface coming in at number three, Freddy coming in at number four, we got Pennywise coming in at number five. We have Chucky coming in at 6. Stan, you little bastard. Ghostface coming in at number 7. Stan, you little bastard. God, dude, these figures, they're so great in detail, but damn, they can't stand. And then number 8, we have Pinhead. So here is the full field. Now we're going to get into the matchup. So if you guys don't know how tournament brackets typically work, we usually work backwards. So typically, the number 1 seed faces the 8 seed, 2 versus the 7, 3 versus the 6, and so on and so forth. So that is actually how we're going to do it. So in our bracket, I still got I make up a mock graphic with, you know, nice lines and everything like that to make it all fancy schmancy for the videos. But at the number one, we are going to have Jason Voorhees taking on Pinhead. This is going to be a very interesting matchup. One that, you know, I don't think these guys have ever crossed paths in any sort of fan films or anything like that. They might have. I don't, I don't think so, Brad. But there is Jason and Pinhead in our first matchup. Next up, guys, is going to be Michael Myers and Ghostface. Now, this one's very interesting because they're both mortal human. Like, as far as we know, regardless Regardless of like the different personas and you know just the reviving qualities of maybe both of them at the bare minimum these guys are straight up human beings with knives so this should be pretty fun to see Michael Myers squaring off a ghost face to two masked guys right there next up is going to be Chucky and Leatherface what a fun matchup I remember back when I was a kid when Freddy vs. Jason first came out I think I was like eight years old or seven when that movie came out and all my friends we used to be like what if they made Michael Myers versus Chucky what if they made Leatherface versus Chucky and like all these fantasy matchups and now we get to bring them to life, Brad. Leatherface versus Chucky should be great. And then our final matchup of the first round is going to be Freddy Krueger going one-on-one -on -one with Pennywise. Both these guys can mess with your mind. They can take they can take things to a whole other realm, so this one should be a fun one. So Freddy versus Pennywise is our last matchup. So if you guys wanted to see the matchups, here they are again. Leatherface, Chucky, Freddy, and Pennywise. Ghostface and Michael Myers. And then we have Jason versus Pinhead. So I know you're pretty bummed out. You know, Annabelle didn't make it into the, into the thing. I don't I don't know how that would have went, but Annabelle is in her glass case right there. I recently picked that up, so I had her in the background there, but you're probably wondering what they're going to compete for, and that is going to be the, not only the MD, the new, improved MDT Horror World Championship or MDT World Horror Championship, still trying to figure that out. We have the new championship. Now, I know this is just the Fiend Universal Championship, but I plan on uh, customizing this up a little bit, and you guys will probably see it in the first round matchup. It should be done by then. Going to customize this up a little bit, see what we can up with this may not be what we use but it's probably the coolest base for a horror championship or a new title and then what i'm really excited about is you guys remember the alley katniss memorial battle royal trophy that will be on the line at my damn nation whenever we get there we also are going to be having a new improved mdt tournament of the damn trophy and this is what i have so far so i took this severed head from the halloween figure put the machete through it and then uh, i'm gonna either mount this to this or come up with some plan to have this as uh, you know part of the trophy here or come up something, come up with something for it. So uh, even if it doesn't stick to this, it will be uh, somehow implanted into this, and you know it'll stick out on top of that. So that'll be a really cool piece right there. So that is what I'm working on currently. So I'm working on the trophy. I'm working on the title belt, and uh, this should be really fun, man. Really excited to uh, see how these things play out. If you guys are wondering, it will not be pick fed style. It is going to be like action figure match slash like I guess hand fed slash you know video fed style, and it should be a lot of fun, man. 
man. So stay tuned for it. Should be very nice. Again, all death matches. Next guy improves, and then next year, you know, we'll probably expand the field, put it all over again, and this should be a really fun ritual or sort of like a new tradition here on the channel. So I have, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Should be a lot of fun, man. But MDT Tournament of the Damned, let me know down below who your prediction is, what you expect out of this, who do you want to see compete for the championship, and all of those different things, man. But that is going to wrap up today's video. I just wanted to put up a little infomercial about it and let you guys know what's coming soon, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it and uh, are looking forward to it, man. Again, I'll probably post a match a few days apart until we get to the matchup on Halloween night. So it should be really awesome, man. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Let me know all the info down in the comment section below. Do you like the idea? All of those different things. But thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Don't cross the line like uh, me for not thinking of this way sooner. You cross